Hi, this is Will. Today we talk about uh, you know the market condition depending on the uh, three terms, which is uh, deflation, and deflation, and inflation. So the we start from the, the the definition of the word. The deflation means the in the market we have less money, and what you can say cash. And then reflation is the you know the the less cash it come back to the market that's reflation. Inflation is too much cash in the market. That's the three uh, uh, the terms of for the you know the today. So let's start from the um, uh, the story from the middle column. Um, is 2019 the um, I think at end of 2019. COVID-19 was uh, found, and then it started to spread to the globally, and the the people be get infected by the virus and become sick, and some people some people are uh, lost their life, and then uh, each country they um, say that they started uh, lock down the board, and then. The stores, the business closed. The, uh, that's the uh, we say uh, lockdown economy, and lockdown economy uh, by the pandemic caused uh, economic condition going down. That we say the recession. Once a recession comes, you know, the, all stores locked down, right? Closed. So. Uh, less cash in the uh, market, so it caused deflation. So the in this condition, um, everybody has a supply. So Fed, uh, Federal Reserve Bank, they um, it uh, lower the its uh, rate. We say federal uh, fund rate. So in uh, all the short term, we say Fed rate. So they lower the Fed rate. Um, down to near zero. So actually, today is the zero uh, percent to the zero point two five percent. And the other way, the Fed start to the buy mortgage backed bond and U.S. Treasury bond. So that's the way uh, you know the Fed support the more cash to the bank. Bank support uh, you know the business and peoples. So that one, that one we call it quantitative easing. So in the short term we say QE. So Fed do the mainly two things: lower the Fed rate and then QE. So they support more cash to the market. So the in the market we the, the amount of cash is gonna growing, and then it we and then. After that, we do the vaccine, and we wearing masks, social distance, and then economic um, recovered little by little. So the more cash come into market, and so that we call um, reflation. So and then after reflation, and then uh, after the vaccination, people come out more. They eat. And they traveling, they will buy clothes. Uh, they fly out, and you know they traveling, and then they usually go to hotel, it's something like that. They do party again. Then um, more money in the market. Then Fed start to uh, sucking up uh, the those extra cash to the uh, Federal Reserve Bank. So the Fed start uh, first thing is the they uh, stop buying um, mortgage-backed bond and U.S. Treasury bond. So the reducing QE and then finally it stops QE. That we call uh, we call uh, tapering. So Fed is gonna start the tapering. After that, um, uh, no more extra cash go into the market. After uh, and then. The still the the extra money in the market, then Fed more uh, circuit up the extra cash by increased Fed rate. So the 
or later on they were expecting the you know the uh, those zero per near zero percent the Fed rate going up little by little, and then um, the, the, it it's like you know the um, uh, so Fed said depending on the speed of recovering, yeah, economic recovering, they're gonna also uh, control the speed of the the rate increase. So so they control the inflation. Okay, um, that that is the you know the the timeline stories. So so one day the we are in the deflation, but we are expecting the inflation is coming um, more sooner. Okay, because now um, in the market the uh, cash is uh, more. So the how we can tell the you know. By product price going up, consumer price going up, then oh, you know, it we say the too much money in the market. So the other one is like you know the uh, the oil price going up, then you know the in the pay for the more gas, and then uh, the everything deliver delivered by you know the spending oil and using the um, product. Um, factory machine also using the oil and they produce more so it's the when oil price going up everything going up and then even the you know the food price going up and the other way is the people spend more money for the, their uh, goods then they uh, rec rec um, they asking their income going up right so and the income goes up, that which means that they uh, using that money they spend more product. Also, the more money comes market, and produce uh, when they selling more uh, product, then uh, they make more money, and then the, they go give to the more income to their employees. So. Um, the employees spend more money in the market kind of way in making the you know the more money cycle so the the, the extra money is in more uh, market the finally it gonna increase the more um, prices uh, so that, that inflation is coming so then um, you know the the business or stores uh, hit by pandemic they gonna um, reopen and then the, they make more money again. They hire more people. So the when we talking about the related the stock investment, we 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 call them epic center stocks or reopening stocks. So um, those stocks going up, then uh, we want to buy those. Okay, let me do it again. Um, so the, 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 the epic stocks going up, the opening stocks going up, then we, well, when we expect it that way, what we, we do, we're going to invest uh, those stocks, right? We buy those stocks. Uh, so that's the, uh, when you see the inflation in head of us, that's what we do, right? So for example, the Warren Buffett running Berkshire Hathaway, um, uh, uh, this time, you know, after the um, first quarter, uh, after first quarter, he, uh, he released his 13F, the Berkshire Hathaway 13F. It shows the um, what uh, stocks that he added more to the Berkshire Hathaway. So the many three things. First thing is the um, uh, Verizon, say, uh, you know, communication company, and then the the wireless wire phone company and the second thing is uh, A1 is insurance company the other one is a uh, cloak uh, it's a supermarket company so um, though uh, when you know the like uh, you using the your cell phone and then the cell phone company increased the, your monthly fee you know you have to using the your cell phone so you accepted the high price right so it's the th those are the price on A1 uh, cloak the, those things is the kind of benefit company for inflation because they even though that they uh, uh, I would say the 
they can increase the price easily and then the consumer gonna pay, willingly pay, right? So that's good for the inflation. So Warren Buffett, it, he, he um, put the more portfolio to the inflation way. And the other one is the Berkshire Hathaway, large of, you know, the cash. They, um, they saving large of cash and then uh, because I, nobody knows his mind, but um, Buffett says uh, not only the you know the um, good price, but also uh, you know the stock price is overvalued. So so stock price also inflation. So um, I mean stock market inflation too, right? So the um, w he is waiting for the you know the. Uh, market recession, the stock market recession. So, what we expecting from the um, past e experience? When when Fed is starting, you know, uh, tapering, and then or Fed rates go up, then market uh, has a lot of you know, liquidity, you know, they have uh, free cashes, but those cashes are the uh, suck up, up to the um, the the Fed. Uh, then the stock price going down, which means the overvalued stock going to be um, undervalued. At that time, we think in Buffett gonna using his uh, lots of cash. So uh, that's the uh, investment strategy for the um, inflation. Okay, now we're talking about the other side. Okay, the other side uh, we're talking about the deflation. As I said, the deflation means the less cash in the market. How come we have uh, less cash in the market? Um, it caused by uh, destructive innovation, not by recession. So the innovation means the, um, we have uh, more robots and AIs, artificial intelligence. They, uh, they making the smart factory. So before was we rely on the human labor. Now the, the smart factory with the robots and AIs, they produce product more efficiently and low cost, 24 hours a, a day and seven days a week. Um, so 24 hours a day, yeah, seven days a week, yeah. And the other one is the uh, also the all service. Uh, you no, know, like in restaurant, restaurant before was the you know, waiter waitress, but uh, later on the robot they working for serving new guys. So it's the also hospital area. Also, the, we're using the AIs and robot. It, it, it gonna replace the human uh, labor, um, and then all, and then innovation field they making the new product, and then it's like a genomic sequence of, uh, field. Uh, the people when take care of the disease, they're gonna using the more expensive um, the medicines. But if we know the genetic problem earlier, then we can uh, cure the disease more earlier, right? So the kind of things that happen, and then the genomic test a few years ago was the more high price, but now the technology more developed, so it's the the same price with uh, same. Uh, same price or low price, they cover more disease, kind of way. So uh, those things have uh, caused the produce price going down, and then they provide the more low uh, price product or services. So the overall the condition uh, making the deflation. So it's a, well, basically uh, technology development bring the deflation, and. In the in those viewpoint, the Cassie Woods, the who running Ark Invest, uh, they making you know the uh, those ETF, uh, basic uh, the most important uh, in famous one is AIKK, and then the AIKW, A AIKG, um, those you know you can look it up to the what kind of company in their holdings, um, so the. Those innovation, uh, in innovative companies, which means the in the uh, stock market field, medium, uh, small cap, uh, growth stocks. 
So um, when you're making your portfolio, then you can um, you can think which side you, your portfolio more have. Uh, when I see my uh, uh, portfolio, then uh, about 60-70% looks like a Buffett way. And then the 20-30% is the Woods way, kind of way. So it's the, um, how much percent you, you do the, you know, um, one, one side way, that, uh, that gonna, uh, later on we're going to see the different return, right? So um, I w today I want to see the, your portfolio and then the, which side, um, which side you see more, inflation side more or deflation side more, and then you, depending on that strategy, you can uh, do like a more Buffett or do like a more Woods. Okay, so I wish you have a, a happy investment. Thank you.